The owner of a hamster sent a WhatsApp message to the vet Dr. Singh on August 13, 2018. Hi, is this Dr. Singh? My two-year, five-month-old Syrian hamster has a swollen right cheek. He is very old already. I am worried that the swelling may burst. Is there anything I can do to treat the swelling? This is a Be Kind to Pets veterinary educational video sponsored by Toa Payo Vets. Singapore is a city with highly dense population. Singaporeans are living in high-rise buildings and we can see apartments easily in Singapore. Old hamster had infected tumors. What is a tumor? A tumor is a swelling of a part of the body caused by an abnormal growth of tissue. This is a Syrian hamster, male, 2 year 5 month old, sent in with a complaint of having a swollen face and two tumors. Here is a footage of physical examination. 14th of August 2018. This is a Syrian hamster, 2 years and 4 months, male, not neutered. So, how old is it? 2 years? 2 years and 4 months. So this one is older. Five months. 2 years and 5 months is older than the other hamster. That's why we have another hamster. Okay, so what is the complaint? So we start with the... What is the... Yeah, there's a, a swelling on the cheek. Swelling on the this cheek. is the main concern. I think there's two heart tumor, one under the chin and one under the other one. Right there. Oh. So, how many? Three. Three, yeah? Yes. So we start by can this a history, yeah? Okay, so I will do the weighing first. Every every patient has to be weighed so that we know if they come again whether they have lost weight or one two one grams uh, for this particular hamster. Now okay, it's not very active compared to the the other hamster, but it, it's because it's quite old. Two years and five months. That means the, the lifespan is about three years. Uh, so yeah. it's considered very Oh, okay. It's about 860 days. Mm. So one to one gram. So you record now. So now, now we will talk about the. Uh, okay, you want you want to hold? Bite you or not? Uh, so if you hold too long, probably. Do you have to hold before? Can can hold. So now you let the you, you can get this to grab me now. Hmm? Sometimes it gets irritates then. Just hold up and down. No, just see the foot. You hold it upside down. It gets. No, okay, really sideways, sorry. So the complaint is the. Swelling on the left face, actually. You see, it's a big swelling here, this part below the eyes. Uh. You compare to this side, there's no swelling. So it's a very obvious swelling below the left eye uh, on the face. Uh. Facial swelling. Come and the chin here. This, is, this is part of physical examination. The chin, yeah, there's a lump there. Well, there's a lump there. This is probably a tumor or abscess. Uh. On the abdomen, there's one. Also. Abdomen, yeah, there's one there. This is a female male? Male. It's probably a tumor, the abdomen one, which is quite common in uh, old hamsters. Yeah. Right yes. uh, so this this is what the owner said. There are three three conditions. Uh, the, uh, three conditions. I'll take it down first. So this being a very old hamster, so we have done the physical examination. Uh, so in this case, the diagnosis is based on physical examination because there is really uh, no need to do x-ray or blood test. Anyway, you can do blood tests in small syringe hamsters. Uh, no, no x-ray, no urine test because the main problem is referring to infection. Uh, infection of the left face and below, below the, this is a tumor or abscess. Uh, we don't know yet. That is the, on the, on the chest area and there's another swelling on the lower part no? so so the treatment is again under surgery so the only thing is it's very risky because the hamster is first of all very thin yeah? Yeah. it's all bones huh? yes, yes. compared to the other hamster just now it's all fat and nice huh? this is bony so it's been sick for some time huh? i would mm, say how long about three weeks uh, so old, old hamsters and old dogs when they're sick they they, they have to be treated uh, early, no? then they, they won't lose weight. No? So not lose weight. So anesthetic is very risky, but unfortunately it has to be done. No? So the, the most important is to drain the abscess first. 
and uh, of course you can send for culture bacterial culture to see which antibiotic is is uh, effective uh. so in, in this case there is one supporting lab test uh, uh, to check the what bacteria so this is the the recommendation uh. so is it okay with you mm, so the risk will be what will be the risk at least uh, 50-50 not least. getting out right yeah dying on the but I will use use gas only and ventilator so what I do I do the abscess first the face the face I let all the pus come out first yeah yeah the face then, is the main concern uh, but he's still eating like you see you see he's still uh, he, the seeds are still inside the yeah, cheek correct, this is but he's incredible eating, yeah he's eating very little of the seeds already so sometimes I give him bread the soft food mm. actually you can tell he's eating very little because it's all bony you see yes yes but I'm surprised it's still holding uh. Yeah. Now we just check the teeth, see whether it's overgrown or not. No, it's not. It's not overgrown, it means yeah, he's got good appetite. Uh, huh? mm. and, he's still responsive. And compared to the other hamster, there's no drooling or saliva coming out, you notice? Yep. There's no saliva salivation. So, so this uh, facial abscess does not involve the neck muscles or the facial muscles. Mm. Or anyway, it doesn't involve the mouth, huh? there's no drooling. So that's okay. good, right? Mm, good. Okay. So did you do the sign that consent form and uh, and uh, conclusion okay. is facial abscess. If it's not it's treated, what will tumor. happen? It will burst. Yeah, it might burst or it might spread to the eye. Then. Mm, yeah. And it's then, spreading to the eyes. Uh, then the hamster keeps on rubbing, scratching here. I don't know whether she does or not. No. And then not at all. Uh, lose appetite. You know? mm. Eventually die of uh, starvation because it doesn't eat. Uh, I think before the huh? abscess, he, she, he already getting thinner. Getting what? Maybe thinner. Thinner? Yeah, maybe because of old age, then he sleep a lot. No, maybe he has this already, he didn't notice. Huh? Oh, probably, yeah. Uh, then, uh, okay. has, has he seen any other bats? No, no. no. Okay. Maybe a vaccination already. Treatment The treatment is abscess lancing and surgical removal of lungs. This hamster had a very high risk for anesthesia. However, the owner gave consent as the right facial swelling was growing bigger. Thus, the vet conducted abscess lensing and surgical removal of neck and abdominal tumors. Here is the picture of the hamster after the removal of three tumors from its neck and abdomen. Outcome 15 minutes after the surgery. 15 minutes after the surgery, now he is waking up from the anesthesia. We take out the lump from him. Now waking up from the anesthesia. 12 hours after the surgery, the hamster passed away. The owner buried the hamster on 16th of August 2018. Tips and advices Firstly, early spotting of neck and lower body tumors. Get a hamster wet to remove them. Secondly, tumors get infected due to hamster scratching and friction with the floor during movement. Next, more nutrition will occur if not treated early. Emaciation and death will happen soon. Conclusion Despite his death, this hamster was well loved and well taken care of by his owner. A normal lifespan of a hamster is two and a half to three years old, so this hamster was strong enough to live until this age and passed away in peace. Before we end this video, let's watch some pictures and videos of this beloved hamster during younger days.
收看今天的晚间新闻，也欢迎下载八频道新闻即时节目收听。We have now come to the end of the video. Credits to the vets Dr. Singh and Dr. Daniel, as well as vet assistant Judy and Sue. For more information, feel free to contact us. If you have any questions, you can email to us via judy at twapayawets.com or visit our website at twapayawets.com. Thank you for watching.